In this video, I will compare the Intel Core i7-14700KF and Intel Core i7-14700K highlighting their differences, and then provide a conclusion to help you determine which one is the better choice. Both of these processors are from Intel, but it comes with same core architecture and clock speeds but they have slight variation in features let's discuss on them. And at last I will provide you my suggestions which processor to choose. Both of these processors were released on October 16, 2023. They each feature 8 performance cores and 12 efficiency cores, along with 16 performance threads and 12 efficiency threads. Having more cores and threads can result in improved multitasking performance, faster processing of multi-threaded workloads, and better utilization of hardware resources. Additionally, both processors have the same base clock frequency of 2.5 GHz for performance cores and a boost clock frequency of 4.3 GHz. The L1, L2, and L3 cache sizes for both processors are 80 KB per core, 2 MB per core, and 33 MB per core, respectively. High cache size aids in faster data access and reduced latency. Both processors support up to 192 GB of RAM and feature the latest DDR modules, including DDR5 and DDR4, with frequencies of 5600 MHz for DDR5 RAM and 3200 MHz for DDR4. The Core i7-14700KF does not support integrated graphics, while the Core i7-14700K supports Intel UHD Graphics 770 with a boost frequency of 1600 MHz. Both processors support ECC, making them suitable for critical systems like servers and workstations. They also support PCI version 5 with 20 PCI lanes, allowing up to 20 different PCIe devices to be used simultaneously. With a peak temperature of 100 degrees Celsius, both processors can operate under maximum load without encountering thermal throttling or damage. The TDP for both processors is 125 watts. Considering price, the Intel Core i7-14000K might have a slightly lower price due to its lack of integrated graphics. They have similar benchmark performance for Geekbench V6 and Cinebench R23. If you want my suggestions then. Choose Intel Core i7-14700K if you lack a dedicated GPU and intend to rely on integrated graphics for tasks such as browsing or light gaming. Choose Core i7-14700KF if you already have a dedicated GPU and won't utilize integrated graphics, seek to save on the CPU cost without requiring integrated graphics fallback. This much for today. If you like this video please like share and subscribe to the channel. Also click on bell icon to never miss any update.